Yeah, it's quite chilly this morning. Well, that pool on the right really looks quite heavy on to me. Uh, he's definitely past the ears. So um, I'd estimate him at about 28 plus. I think he's worth having a closer look, yeah. Them over there, Steve. Let me just give it a, a while. Sit down here. Um, we don't have a approach path. So let's just see, maybe they, they're grazing slightly towards us and then we can have a better look. Yeah, so Steve, we spotted these four bulls now. Um, we came in slightly closer. Um, we did see them on previous occasions and um, we of the opinion that there's another group of eight bulls that we've also seen yesterday morning and that we've got a much better bull in that group. Um, we know where these guys are now, so I think we're slowly going to just uh, retrieve back to the vehicle. We're not going to spook them unless I, they see us when we stand up. Stevie looks really good to me. Um, I really think that's something we should take. It's a nice one. Yeah. Steve, get on. So the one in front of the group, that one that turned now. Right. Yeah. Let's just see what he does. Okay, there's your shot. If you're ready, you can take it.
Well, Steve, he's basically finished. Congratulations on a very good blue wildebeest bull. Um, just mind, he might give you another kick or so. But yeah, I think it's, it's a really decent bull. Yeah. Just going to have a look from the front end. Been looking at some blue wildebeest here and we've been trying to trying to get close to a couple of different groups and, and uh, we finally around 2.30 got up pretty close to this guy here and, and uh, took a good shot at him and he dropped real good and uh, real happy with that. It's good to see them when they drop on the first shot. I hear that they're a really tough animal and they sometimes if you don't hit them in the right spot they'll keep running and running and running and so I'm happy to, that we didn't have to run after it. And uh, so I thank you, Yuri, for getting me on them. Make it. Steve, well done. Yeah, they are extremely tough animals, and um, we don't see it often that they go down with one shot. And um, you were covering it well afterwards in case it got up, you were ready for him. Yeah. And I wanted to mention the Umberto and the, our tracker and Skinner here that come along and help us out on the, each day here tracking and recovering these animals and, and, and cleaning them and dressing them and making them into what they are. Um, a beautiful trophy for down the road. And uh, without them, it, uh, it wouldn't all come together. And so really happy to have everybody here join in. It's been an exciting hunt. Yeah, and thank you, Steve. Without you, none of us would be here. So we really um, love hosting you guys and um, thanks for for allowing us to also do what we enjoy. Yeah, yeah we really appreciate that. Well, I'm envious of your job too. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I wish I could stop farming and come do what you do. Yeah. Be, got, I like your occupation. It's got its ups and downs, <laughs> but we love it. Yeah. yeah.